Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Your Excellency Mr. Muntaha as the Headmaster of Junior High School Slawi The Honorable Miss Kelly as the Builder of Student Council Junior High School Slawi and the respectable Mr. Arfan as the leader of Student Council Junior High School Slavi and all students here whom I love. First of all, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Muhammad Rizki Utomo, but you can call me with Mr. Rizki. I'm from Tegal and I work at Zinius Technology Company. The second, I would like to say thank you very much for having me. I'm delighted to be here. And what is beautiful day is it? I'm happy to share it with all of you. As you know, our today's topic, we are going to talk about how to build students' character who wise in using internet. Ladies and gentlemen, recently, many people already know about internet. And I think no one's people doesn't know about internet. Is it right, guys? Yeah, it, it is right. Almost all activities right now need an internet. For example, when you want to communicate with the other people and then the other people is far from your home but you want to communication with him you can use internet to communication between you and him and then you as students when you have an assignment and then you don't know what assignment and I think you need an internet to search in Google or any else about the assignment like that. Guys, I have a question for you all. What do you think about internet? Or what is your image about internet? What? Freedom? Mm. Happiness? Hmm. Can know everything with internet? Hmm. It is right guys, but it is just part of things in the internet. Well, when you talk about internet, one thing that you should know about internet is internet is like an ocean. It is very large for us to explore it and you can know everything in internet. Not only having things or positive things you can know from internet, but you can deal with the negative side in internet. For the example is murder, promiscuity, pornography, bullying, and online gambling yeah that's all the example of the negative side of internet so you as students you should wise to using internet so that the internet can be useful for you all here i have some ways for you all to wise in using internet okay the first is you can use internet for things that support your study for example when you want to learn English you can use internet to open YouTube Google website or etc so it will help you guys for study the second, you must avoid the things or the negative things in internet. When you deal with the negative content in internet, you can close or move to the positive content. 
And third, don't spend a lot of time on internet. Because when you spend a lot of time on internet, you can forget the time. The fourth, when you have social media, you can post a positive post or useful post for the other people. The last, when you using social media, not all things you have to share in social media. The most important thing is your privacy don't to share in social media. Because in social media, many people can see your privacy when you start the privacy. Ladies and gentlemen, as I said before in the beginning of the speech, that internet is pretty large for us to explore it and internet is like an ocean. So, you as a students, you have to selective for things that in internet. Take the positive things in the internet and get rid of the negative things in the internet. So, the internet can be useful for you all. Hopefully, the tips for me can be useful for you all in the future. Then as I say, see you later and goodbye. Mabilahi tabi kwa Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.